Um, for my demo, Kevin, can I actually steal you at the beginning? Yep. Um, just to demonstrate how it works. I thought, so I do these jumpers. <laughs> I've also with me, there's nine, nine of these guys, nine characters. But I want you to pick your favourite. This guy does events, this guy's into music, so whichever one you prefer. Okay, cool. Come on. So it's a big Put it on. Well, if you like it. <laughs> Don't tweet that. I won't tweet that. <laughs> Everyone has to tweet it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that Sorry. That's it. <laughs> okay, cool. That's it. Can I take it up? Yeah, or you can stand there. Big wall if you want. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um, okay, so now I'll start. So this is yeah. Um, yeah, I'm a product designer. My background is product design. Came to London five years ago. Met a bunch of really cool people. Everyone could never get them in a room together. So none of those guys kind of knew each other. And I was thinking, how could I start a project to bring them together and start to build a community? Um, so I did these jumpers with characters on them and used those people that I know as the inspiration for those characters and then use them as the models and um, yeah, that was kind of us all getting together. Um, business is moving along and there's two phases that I want to show you. The first is right now when we're about to launch um, and then the second part is where I'd like to go with it um, and I'd really like to get your feedback. I'm not digital at all, I have um, no experience in digital, I don't know how to use Twitter. Um, <laughs> So you guys are really, really good to throw things at me, tell me what might be good, what, what might not work, and um, yeah, so I'll just, I'll go for it and see what you think. Um, so at the moment, and this is very rough, um, this is a Shopify website, now instead of just doing a product, okay, you can buy a jumper, right? You could buy that jumper. Um, what I've actually done is set up profile pages. Um, so if you, for example, she's into the environment, if you're into the environment, you might pick the B. Um, so she has a profile page, which is also her product page. Um, profile, she's whatever, whatever she's into. Um, so yeah, there's the design. But what's happening is, if I go home and tag Kevin, he's going to come up in the robot's Facebook because the robot has a, a name and a Facebook profile. Um, and then we're pulling the photos. So Kevin will actually come up in my website, and you could as well if you, if you were a robot. So if Kevin was in Madrid and I was in London and we were both wearing robots, we'd actually cross over in the digital world um, through a product. So yeah, so like social images, and I like videos, so I'm going to put another little one on. Just to give you an example, this could be, um, 
user-generated data. So each character has its own hashtag as well um, that you can associate with through social media. Um, so yeah, that's sort of where we're at at the moment. Um, and I just want to show you vision and where I'd like to take it. The first little bit you've already got through the video, so I'll skip through that quickly. I don't know what's going on here. You get the end of it. Oh, let me try again. Right, you have to make it quick because you've already gone through seven minutes. Have I? Right. Yeah, so you can, we can give you like another 30 seconds. Oh, okay, then I'll just... <laughs> I'll go really, 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 really quick. Okay. <laughs> Magic jumpers, they connect you with people. Digital real world has a name, social media profiles. Basically what I've been explaining, but my idea is to have an economy. So if you were tweeting and Facebooking, etc., 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 you're generating threads, and then you could actually use them at our events to buy drinks, come and party with us, etc. Um, there's some wearable tech in there, an app. Um, we have a big vision. Da 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 da. There's a party. Um, but actually, like, all we want to do is have a bit of fun and not take ourselves too seriously. There you go. That's us. Um, okay, this is, this is where I'm stuck. Um, and these are questions that go through my head, but you don't have to answer them. They're just like things for you to feedback on. Do you want to pick your like, most pressing thing that you need feedback on? Pick one, because it's quite small print. Yeah, sorry. That's all right. Um, okay, I'd like to know, like, oh, I guess you guys didn't really see them, but which characters are your favorite? And also, um, any tech that you think might actually work to help manage those profiles and get them out. Because in the beginning, it's going to be us pushing content out before anyone else is pushing back. So anything other than like the very obvious ones that might actually help manage that. Because I mean, nine social profiles is a lot to take on. So. Yeah, that's how many we had for three beers when I first started. Yeah. We reduced. All right, big round of applause for Jess. <laughs> and who's got some feedback or questions? It's product. So um, the first one there is the jumper, um, is, is, is money. Um, and then around each character, you can see accents. So like on my jumper, there's, a, there's this web, and that connects all the, that's like a, a brand accent. So around the robot, for example, we'll do all brown, green, yellow shoes, really cool coats, things like that. So on a product level, there's that. There's the event side of it, which may or may not take off, and then down the core of it, and which could actually hold the business up once it gets past this, like, because because not ev not everyone's going to buy everything, but it could actually become a content company. So, if the robot is always talking about music and there's a big community, then it's actually a content company. So there's those three channels, I guess. Who else? This guy here. I was just thinking, in terms of um, how you could incentivize people to sort of put up content. So if, if I had a robot and I, you know, I put up loads of pictures and videos, maybe I could have exclusive access to the new jumper or something. 
Yeah, so, uh, so it could become like a member get member or loyalty scheme, some, some sort of mechanism. Absolutely. So you could actually use your threads to buy more product. You don't have to buy drinks or whatever at the bar. Um, and you will also get threads for bringing someone into the community. So if someone sees your jumper, and actually how the business has started is through people saying, where the hell did you get that jumper I wanted? So if that happens to you and you're part of the community, um, there will be a mechanism where you could actually be rewarded for that. Cool. And in terms of, like, um, I, I don't know how, how you're selling it, but I think, you know, ASOS Marketplace is a really good place for this. Because mm -hmm. um, there's loads of boutique designers and products. And I, I, I kind of think it fits the student community as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that was it, really. Cool, thank you. Just because he said student, I remember we, we used to always have a lot of theme nights. Hmm. I've been Lumpa Lumpa or Smurf, I'm sure you all have as well. And if you haven't, you should be. Um, so perhaps there's something there with the student nights, like get the different halls, like one halls are all frogs. And one idea, halls are all one idea that we're playing with actually is to get an agency or someone to sponsor a character that we would make for that agency and then play the agencies off against each other, for example. Like, um, yeah, well, same thing with the university stuff. Cool, any more questions? Anyone over there? Coming round. Have you thought about the longer term potential here with VR? Because when I saw that video initially, I wasn't sure <clears throat> if this was about VR and I'm, using the characters in that way? It's really cool. I, yeah, we have, it's quite undeveloped though. And it's a really risky thing, this, in terms of not, I don't want it to end up gimmicky. So I feel like VR right now is still very gimmicky, very, very, very gamey. And I don't want to be a merchandise company. So the idea is to do these fun characters, to build a community, to get people talking about our product but then do really high market, really fashionable, like leather coat, beautiful shoes and things like that. So yes, VR when it's there and when there's some adoption in it, but like as a startup, but yeah. God, we could have fun with it if it, you know, it's amazing that stuff, so. Kevin, how many, how many more? One? Uh, more than one. More than one, good, good. I can walk around a bit more. Hi, yeah, I, I kind of like it. And um, do you say there's going to be location-based beacons as well? Yeah, yeah. There, so, there, so that'll just it's picked up automatically. That's all possible. So, like, um, for example, if this was a really thriving business, the idea had taken off, you could actually, yeah, with that chip, yeah, I, I can find you. I can find a robot. I can locate by interest. All of that stuff. I can see that just adding a really nice dimension to it, a really broad dimension to it. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Cheers. Someone's at the back? No, that was me. No? Hi. Um, just, a, just a comment of feedback. You might have to think of the jumper as well for the light, because you were very hot, like Middle East or some states. <laughs> You're talking about temperatures. Temperatures. Yeah, absolutely. So, so even. even sorry, excuse me. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, abso absolutely. Yeah. Um, and in terms of London, even if it stays in London, next summer we're in a bit of trouble. Yeah. So, you would, do, you would do the first range as sunglasses or hats or something summary. Or t-shirt. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or a t-shirt, yeah. Yeah, which we've just actually done. Right. So, yeah. yeah. Very cool. Go on, who's going to give me the last, last question or feedback? No? Well, in which case, we'll move on. Thank you so much, Jess. <laughs>